all units. Receiving reports of a robbery. Suspects are armed. Please proceed to Chelsea ASAP. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Okay, the average is... Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit.
Finished. The signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I call that a mild success. I call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Ah, uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future. I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. What is this, Doc? Never seen this type of material. Would you believe it's for welding? 
provides remarkable magnetic insulation and limits cross-contamination between the neural interface and arms. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Hmm. Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch, noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Electro was the first legit super-powered villain I fought. Till then it had been regular guys in fancy suits. Electro was a big change. Big change. Last time I fought Scorpion, he asked if I knew what my skull looked like from the inside. Then offered to show me. Super fun guy. Gonna miss that humorless grimace. Mob Enforcer turned walking tank. Rhino's racked up enough property damage to destroy Manhattan three times over. Vulture might be the smartest guy up on this wall. Not smart enough to duck three consecutive life sentences, of course, but still pretty brainy. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye. <laughs> 